These are Rosie's four babies, and I'm going to check them. Two of them are banded. I'm going to check and see if the third one is ready yet. I'm going to take it out and look at it. This is Peaches and her five babies. I just moved them around to see if they could be banded yet. The two in the front are banded. One will be a normal and one will be a rosy. And the reason we know this is because of the feet. Look how dark his feet are. So he is going to be a normal. This one Whoops, that one looks dark too. Well, maybe we have two normals. Yep, could be that there's two normals in there with those dark feet. Yeah, let's look at somebody else's feet. Let's see. Now this one is either, has pink eyes, so it's either a Lutino or a Rubino. And look how light the feet are. Yeah. So, yeah, the dark feet are a giveaway. This pair produces both uh, Latinos, Rubinos, Normals, and Rosies. Let me see back here. Come here. Oh, ooh. This baby will be, I think, a Rosie. Yeah. Goodness gracious. So we'll leave you alone for now. Bye-bye. Okay. This is Rosie's baby. Now, I've waited a little while to get this. This is our third in a clutch of four. The first two are banded. So I have five birds left to band. Two of them are Rosie's. And three of them are Peaches. So I want to make sure I get the right number. That's number eight. And this one I think is nine. Yep. So we want to put eight on her. Uh huh. I have mineral oil to try to make it slide on easier. Get those three longest toes in here. Yeah, there you go. Hold on. Don't don't pull back. Do not pull back. Make sure I have all three toes. Whoops. No pulling back. Come on. See, we, there's a little joint there. And that littlest toe is going to have to be pulled through later. So this is why we wish we had done it a little sooner. It doesn't want to slide over that knuckle. There we go. There we go. There's no doubt that this toe or this particular band is never coming off. Uh -huh. Hold still. There we go. We pulled that last toe through with the toothpick. Yeah. I don't know if you can see him or not, but what are you doing here? Let's see if the camera will pick him up. This is not this bird's parent, but he's very concerned about her. Yeah. Stormy, you need to go back. I checked Stormy's babies too to make sure that they were, see if they were ready to, to band or not. And um, so he's, he'd be happy to feed this baby. <laughs> it's not even his. But he's got some about this size. Yeah. Okay. Time to put the baby back in the box and return. Storm. All right, babies. Time to get a band on you two. Hello there. Hey, Stormy. We're going to band your little one. Two of your little ones. Yes. We have two that are banded that I think are going to be normals like their dad. And then we have these two that have red eyes. And I believe they will be either Lutino or Rubino. Mm -hmm. Get the little toe out. Oop. Come on, it's okay. It's alright. No, it doesn't want to come. There. 
there, you're done. I'm sorry. But now you have a band. Yes. And I think it's going to be Lutino. It has, seems to have a little bitty tiny white feathers coming out. Don't pick at them. And then this one also has red eyes. Yeah. Look how full they are. Yeah, you've just been stuffed really full. Stormy, you don't need to get in the box. Now this one, I'm debating if I want to wait another day. I'm afraid the band might come off. I don't know. Your toes are big. Let's give it a try. Let's give it a try, shall we? Okay. <clears throat> that third toe coming forward. The three longest toes. There we go. When they're small like this, they're easier to slide the band on. But sometimes the, the mother will take the band off or they'll kick it off themselves. So, so I always check like the day, a few days, every day for several days afterwards to make sure that it didn't come off. There we go. There you are, all banded. Alrighty, so shall we put them back now? We have two more to band, one of Rosie's, the youngest of Rosie and the youngest of Peaches. Well, I left the box open up there, hoping that maybe Peaches would come out and fly around a little bit, but she hasn't. So, we'll have a look at her. Yeah, step up on a step stool here. Hello, Peaches. Your other three babies are in there. Yes. We're going to give you these two back. Mm -hmm. Okay. There we go. There's that one. Yeah. Stormy, you need to go home too. There you are. There, babies. Peaches is an excellent mother. She's hand fed, very tame. Let's put this baby back over here. I moved him when I wanted to get the others out. They typically stay right together. Yeah. And Stormy is down here wandering around. Come here, Storm. I want you to go home now. Come on, you can go home. Go. Good boy, go. Okay, whoop. I think she's mad at you. Yeah. She says, you shouldn't have left us. Do you want to come out, Peaches? You can. You want to come out? Pretty girl. Okay, I'm going to close the door before Stormy comes out. Okay. Get your head in, huh? Okay, I better put the camera down and let her come out. I can't let go of the <laughs> the guillotine up here. Come here, sweetie. Come on, you could come out if you want to. Yes, now your mate's out. That's just what I didn't want you to do. Go. Okay, we're going to close things up and put Stormy back. Bye, Peaches. Bye-bye, sweetie. Maybe you'll come out with the... Babies are a little bit older. Bye-bye.